Good morning everyone. In this tutorial I will show you how to turn a word search into a cookie stencil. I first went online and searched word search maker several to choose from. I used the top result here, the puzzle maker. And you put in your parameters of how many rows, how many letters each way. Let's see. So here, the numbers of letters across, I chose five and five. Um, the title will appear at the top of your page. Word search options, share letters occasionally is what I chose since I was putting in so few letters, I figured we would need to share them. And it doesn't really matter here unless you're planning to print this. I was just using it to get the words and what order the letters needed to be in. Then you put in your words separated by commas or spaces and it creates the puzzle for you. So then I took a screenshot of that so that I could use it as a cheat sheet to put the letters in. In a new window here in Design Space, I chose the font Stencilia A because it's already bridged and then I don't have to worry about it. It cut very well with the letters being half an inch tall. So I'm going to go ahead and say 0.25 inches tall and that makes it 0.211 wide. And then just type in all of the letters for your puzzle. My first letter was an E. And I put one space in between each letter here. And then just enter them in your five rows. two more rows here to go. I'm not really checking for typos or anything here because I just want to show you guys how to make this stencil. So this puzzle may not solve when I'm done. Let's see. And then so now all of these letters are the 0.25 inches. You will also want to put in either on this stencil or on a separate cookie. That could make a difference in what size cookie you need as well. You want to put in what the words are somewhere or you could even make a sheet on your computer that you put as a tag on the bag that has the letters and the, or the words that they're needing to find. I went ahead and put them. As you can see, I didn't want to uh, create a separate cookie. I didn't want to have to print something out. So I went ahead and put the words right here. So love card. This was a first draft. So as you can tell, it's a little bit different. I changed it up after that. So love card, rose, deer, and hug. Love card, rose, deer, and hug. And then I'm going to center all of this right here in the alignment so that hug goes to the middle. And place a shape. This will be your stencil frame, this square. And since I'm going to be using a bigger cookie, I would make this six inches square. Grab my text, move that to the front so I can see it. Shift, create, shift key and grabbing my square as well. I'm going to align that and center it. And attach. And there you have it, that simple. You have on one stencil your puzzle as well as the words they're supposed to look for. You could place your uh, pio dots here on the side 
so that they can circle the letters in a couple of different colors. You could move hug over, you know, make it your own and have fun with it. If you have any questions, feel free to place them in the comments. Thank you and have a great day creating.